I just want to do a real quick video here to show something very interesting. These are the three videos I did uh, on Steven Anderson back when he announced that he was going to be attacking the Jewish people with his absurd propaganda film Marching to Zion. And I brought out the fact that his uh, two-part sermon series, The Jews and Their Lies, is actually based off of a tract written by Martin Luther. And I had some people, I brought that out up here in this video, I had some people say, oh, that's not true, that's not true. He didn't base it off of that. You know, he just is innocent. You know, he, he made this sermon, The Jews and Their Lies, and he just really didn't know that, you know, that uh, that was from Martin Luther. Well, that doesn't quite work out. Because my wife, doing some research today, she came here to Amazon.com, and she found uh, Stephen Anderson's wife's activity here on Amazon.com. And down here, you go down in, and it says, The Jews and Their Lies by Martin Luther. Oh, and there's a review. Not the full book. This is a short version. The longer version of the book is much better. Be advised that this is heavily abridged. Down here, The Jews and Their Lies, On the Jews and Their Lies by Martin Luther. It's not about race. It is exposing a wicked religion. Right. If only Martin Luther's modern-day followers would read this book, they might actually believe correctly about the Jews. Don't write him off as anti-Semitic. Okay, first of all, let me just correct something here. The Lutherans of today are anti-Semitic. They are into replacement theology. Uh, my wife was raised Lutheran. She knows all about that. So this just shows ignorance of what Lutherans believe. Lutherans are Catholics. Uh, just the same thing as Anderson and his wife. But it says here, the book makes it clear that it is their religion that is the problem, not their so-called race. Yeah, right. That, that is a total lie. Absolute total lie. It's some of the things that Martin Luther wrote about, about the Jews is just disgusting. I'll be bringing out some more stuff on that in the future. But Martin Luther wants them to convert to Christianity. Yeah, Catholicism. Only Nazis and Zionists considers Jews, consider being Jewish a race. It is a religion. Yeah, right. But then you have over here DNA Science and the Jewish Bloodline by Tex Mars. You know, finally a biblically accurate book about the Jews. Uh, wait a second, I thought over here you're saying that the Zionists consider Jewish a race, and yet you're talking about the Jewish Bloodline. DNA Science and the Jewish Bloodline. Uh, that's not religion there, rocks for brains. This is, uh, this is about the, the race here. Hmm. You know, down here they have a, a book written by a lost man about the Talmud. And I'm not a fan of the Talmud. It, it is a wicked book. But again, that doesn't say, oh, then the Jews are done and whatever. And you say, well, Brian, this is all just Stephen Anderson's wife writing this stuff. No, because down here you have this shoe thing. And it's, you know, Pastor Stephen L. Anderson. Right there you have it. But I want to show you something else kind of interesting here. Up here you have this... Paul Wittenberger film and you know he goes in best film on water fluoridation and this is another thing that you're gonna see with Steven Anderson let's go to his channel here on YouTube um, the guy has got a serious problem look at this we'll go to playlists I noticed this not too long ago liked videos open link a new tab It's all his stuff. He just goes around. It's not all even his own channel. He just goes around and he, he likes, you know, his own videos. You know. Goes down through here. It's almost all about himself. The guy just spends his time going through YouTube. And anybody else that... Uh, puts up his videos, he goes in and he likes their videos and likes and likes and likes and likes and likes. Go back up to the playlist. Favorites. I think you know what's coming here. It's all his own videos. Favorite, 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 favorite. All his own stuff. Hmm. Very little of it is anything from anyone else or about anything else, you know. Oh, there's one attacking me, so you got to, you know, favorite that, you know. This guy's got some serious problems. 
You say, well, what about you, Brian? What about you? Well, what about me? Let's go to my likes. Well, there's a, I'm a big fan of Wrangler Star. I like the, a lot of the outdoor things that he does, the non-electric uh, hand tool type of things. I have a very similar background to Cody from Wrangler Star. Brian Moonan's video, good video on the Georgia Guidestones. Um, Brother David Daniels from Czech Publications on the Bible version issue. Rick Jacoby on the uh, Israel moment testimony. Now here's one that's, I get a little carnal here, you know, I'm looking at homemade donuts on the wood cook stove, you know. Uh, it's really, really bad there, you know, getting worldly here. Israel moment, Israel moment, these are good videos, you can watch those. Stephen Anderson doesn't believe the Bible. Reprobates by Brian Moonan. You know, going down through here, you can see a bunch of things. This is kind of an interesting thing here. These, this weird honey that grows up in the mountains of Nepal. They pollinate these toxic flowers, and you can get really uh, high and, and everything. It's like a drug in this honey. Interesting thing there. But, you know, go on down through. Uh, I haven't liked a single one of my videos. Hmm. I don't need to go around and, and uh, make it look like I'm really popular. You know, I just let the Lord take care of that. You know? But here you see this, this whole thing. You can see the hypocrisy again right here. It's not about race. Oh, but over here, DNA, DNA science and the Jewish bloodline. Anderson's nuts. I would recommend staying away from this heretic right here.